an LCSW therapist at Kaiser Mental Health. I'm a licensed marriage family therapist for Kaiser Permanente. My favorite part of the job is working with patients and working with the treatment team. It's personable. I like working with people. I enjoy seeing people progress. I know that social workers working for child protective services and adult protective services, their caseloads are huge and they struggle and they work very hard. But listen to my sorry tale. Several years ago, there was a movement to leave SEIU. NUHW did a campaign wanting to be our union and promising us very good local representation because they're a smaller union. They tried to tell people, your contract isn't any good, we'll get you a better contract. There was a vote taken and a majority of my colleagues uh, voted to leave SEIU. A lot of things have changed but not for the good. NUHW manipulated us and they lied to us and they have not dealt with us in good faith. We have no contract with NUHW since we started with them. They promised that they would get us everything that we had with SEIU and more. Three years, nothing with NUHW. Leaving SEIU was a critical mistake. It put the defined pension at risk. It put the current health plan at risk. And it certainly put weight scale at risk. I feel pretty hopeless and powerless. That's a lot to lose in anybody's career. I'm worried about my benefits right now. We've been working without a contract for three years. Voting to form an independent uh, small union uh, is not a good way to negotiate for a position of strength. I don't think it's realistic to think that you could come up against a big organization or a big bureaucracy and expect that you could make headway with a really small union. The local representation is so poor. I don't feel like I have any representation, none whatsoever. If I had an issue at work, an NUHW member couldn't go in and represent me. I'm off on my own. NUHW just doesn't have the, the numbers and the power to, to have the kind of voice that we need to represent us at Kaiser. The only thing NUHW could do right now in regards to Kaiser is to call it a strike. We've had four strikes under our belt now and we've had absolutely no progress whatsoever. It's really frustrating to go on strike and lose that pay. I'm a single mom with three kids and one of my daughters is in college. It's, I have a lot of high expenses, so it's a sacrifice for me to go on strike and lose those days of pay. These strikes is not producing anything. They've failed miserably. They've failed spectacularly. Obviously, the primary erroneous decision was to choose to leave the International, to leave SEIU. The union movement was built on the blood and sweat of helping each other, not fighting against each other. This manipulation to make workers fight against each other instead of having workers united, which is what the union is really all about. I would strongly encourage people to not focus on you know, personality uh, clashes and or differences. Uh, uh, you need to focus on basic issues, you know, benefits package, health plan, and wage scale. Don't make the mistake that we made. You're jeopardizing not only a decent contract, but future contracts. <laughs>